Matt, let's get to today's top story, though, and it's a trail of destruction from violent storms in Colorado. Al's here with more on that. We were talking about this yesterday. There was an area that we were going to see bring severe weather, and it came, unfortunately. This is Longmont, Colorado. Uh, as you can see, one tornado touching down. Simla, Colorado, also seeing a tornado. Upwards of eight tornadoes that we know of have touched down in Colorado overnight. Two dozen homes and businesses destroyed. Look at some of the damage we're talking about. Roofs ripped off homes, barns destroyed. There was massive flooding in Wyoming with this same situation. And we've got some amazing video of hail to show you. You hear the hail there? Take a look at some of the hail. They were literally shoveling hail in Denver, Colorado. Amazing stuff. Upwards of six inches of hail that deep causing big problems. And we've got more severe weather to talk about this morning. As you can see right now, strong storms firing. This is the same system that came out of Colorado now threatening Kansas City. It has been raining there all night long with heavy thunderstorms. So this is the area we look at for a severe risk, a slight risk of severe weather. 20 million people could see hail, damaging winds, isolated tornadoes. We move into tomorrow. We have an enhanced risk from Iowa on into Nebraska. 17 million people at risk for damaging winds, hail two inches in diameter or more, and continues right into Sunday from Denver all the way to Indiana. 55 million people at risk, guys, for more damaging winds, hail. We're not saying we're going to be looking at tornado outbreaks, but there is the possibility as we move right on into the weekend for that area. We'll come back to you in a second, Al.